Hey kiddos, I have a really cool pirate science activity that we can do today for Raider Day. Would you like to do it with me? Awesome. Okay, well, what do pirates like to search for? Hidden treasure. Yeah, so this science activity is going to have some hidden treasures. Here what here's what you need. You need some baking soda and water. I have some water in this cup. You'll need a bowl and a spoon for mixing. This is optional. This is something you don't have to have, but if you have it at your house, you can use some in this project as well, some jello powder. I've got some blue raspberry. You're also going to need an ice cube tray. And then later on in our science activity, we're going to be using some vinegar and you'll want to have a tray to pour it onto. Okay, well, here's what you do. And mom and dad will need to help you with this part. You need three parts baking soda plus one part water. So however much you're mixing up, if mom or dad decide to use a cup of baking soda, then they'll need to use one third cup of water, okay? Three parts baking soda to one part water. And you wanna mix that up. Now, if you have some Jello, like I had in my cupboard, I added a little bit of Jello powder in here to my mixture. I've already put the baking soda and I'm going to put some water in there now. So remember, three parts baking soda, one part water, and then I added some uh, Jello powder. And you're going to just mix that up. It's like a, a blue mixture in here. If you've got orange jello, it'll be orange or red. And what you're gonna do is you're going to put that, you're gonna put that into your ice cube tray. So once you have that all mixed up, you'll put about half of it into each ice cube tray. And then you'll wanna find some kind of treasure that you want to bury inside of here. It could be some gems. It could be something, a little trinket that you have, maybe some money. And then mom and dad will want to help put the rest of that mixture over top of whatever you hid inside the ice cube tray. Okay. Now this part, you're going to need a little bit of patience for. Mom and dad are going to have to put that ice cube tray that has the mixture of baking soda, water, and maybe a little bit of jello, and then your hidden treasures into the freezer. And it needs to freeze overnight. So you'll start this project today, but you'll put it in the freezer overnight and you'll have some cool treasure chests to get out the next day. And that's what I have. I have some that I put in the freezer last night. And here are my treasure chests. I'm pretending that they're treasure chests and now I'm going to take them out. Oh, they're already starting to get a little bit of little bit melty here because I had them sitting out waiting just for you. Awesome. Okay, so here are some of my treasure chests that were frozen overnight and I want to find out what is hiding inside of them. So I'm going to take, this is where you'll need some vinegar. Tomorrow morning when your treasure chests are frozen and you pull them out of your freezer, mom or dad can help you pour a little bit of vinegar into a container. And you'll maybe, if you have a little medicine dropper, that would be awesome. I didn't have one, so I'm just using a little teaspoon. I'm going to take my vinegar and I'm going to put it onto my treasure chests and see what happens. Oh, oh, I hear it. I hear it fizzing. Maybe if I put this up, you can hear it too. And you can watch. Do you hear it fizzing? Do you hear that? Oh, and it's bubbling. It's bubbling and I'm starting to see something in these treasure chests that's hiding that I want to uncover. In fact, I, I want to pour a little bit more vinegar on here and see if I can really uncover the treasure that's in there. Oh, I see something shiny. Do you see something shiny? Oh, and then you get to play with it with your fingers and you get to go digging in your treasure chest and see what you can find. Oh, I think I see something. 
Oh, what is this? Oh, looks like a penny. I found a penny in my treasure chest. Oh, I'm going to keep digging around in here. I see some other things in there. Oh, this one is really coming apart. It's kind of cold. My fingers are cold. Oh, I think I might have found another penny. Oh, this one's breaking apart. Oh, that's a different treasure. What is that? Do you see that? I found another coin. This is a dime. Oh, I just dropped my dime. Okay, let's see. There are all kinds of treasures in here. How fun is this? And my vinegar is making those treasure chests. I'm going to say that they're kind of like exploding. They're not really exploding, but they're fizzing and they're falling apart. Ooh, I see another treasure in here. This is a little bit bigger. Oh, I see another coin. This is a nickel. Yeah, I found a nickel. Well, I'm going to keep looking in my treasure. Now, if mom or dad help you with this activity, maybe um, they could hide some things in the treasure chest that you don't know about. Or maybe you could hide some things in there for your brother or sister. You need to make sure that you ask mom or dad before you hide it. But you can hide things in, in this little mixture that we made. You can freeze them in the freezer. And then the next day, you can take them out and pour some vinegar over them. And they will uh, dissolve. And you can find the hidden treasure inside your treasure chest. Okay. Oh, and you know what? It smells really good, too. You know why it smells good? because of that jello powder that I used. Yeah, would you wanna eat this though? Oh no, that vinegar would not taste very good. So you wouldn't want to eat these. You wouldn't wanna eat these treasure chests. These are just for finding some hidden treasures. Okay, well have fun kiddos. I'll see you in a little bit. Bye for now.